Hey guys, see I'm here. Uh, no fancy intro with this one. I just wanted to give you guys a quick update on the state that the show has been in. As you imagine, I've been rather busy lately, so I haven't had quite as much time to crank out episodes at the pace that I've been going for the last little while. I have been working on a couple, uh, but I've been suffering from massive writer's block thanks to an abundance of other creative endeavors that I've kind of fallen into lately. I've uh, recently gotten some more clients with my graphic design work. I've been getting a lot more commissions. So writing's been, been kind of tough. Um, I have like 20 movies picked out that I want to review, and I've written notes and reviews for maybe three or four of them, and even those aren't really finished. But um, I'm going to start working on that a, a little more tighter uh, soon. Um, what you can expect from me over the, the next little while because I am going to try to produce like more work. Um, I've got another show in mind. It's uh, I've, I've got some, some working titles for it, but basically it's called Black Sheep Cinema or, you know, like something like that. And, and what I'm aiming to do with that one is to take movies that I feel are wrongfully judged and don't get nearly the amount of credit that they deserve. Like, the first episode I have lined up for it is uh, Nightmare on Elm Street 2, Freddy's Revenge, and of course other ones. Uh, since you know me, I'm a huge Friday the 13th fan. For those that watch the Cinemasochist, uh, I'm going to be doing uh, Friday the 13th Part 5. I'm also a huge Halloween fan. I want to do Halloween 3. I feel like that's a very... Um, you know, it's a movie that doesn't get nearly as much credit as it deserves. So that's that's something you can, you can look out for maybe the next month or two. Um, also, to keep production going, I thought it might be cool to do commentaries on some of the older episodes, like on uh, like on Cabin Fever and Anthropophagus. Just basically something to to keep uh, production going, um, you know, week to week, just, just putting out uh, more, more video logs like this. Not necessarily just me talking about this update shit, you know, because I, I really don't like getting in front of the camera and doing this kind of stuff anyway. Um, but you, you can expect to see more, like, just recent movie video logs, like like the whole CM Shoots thing and, and the thing I did with Cabin in the Woods. Like, I've got something planned out that I want to do with Piranha 3DD, uh, which which is going to be kind of like a cross between the the new Piranha 3DD and a retrospective on Piranha 2. Um, if you know anything about James Cameron, you probably know where I'm going to go with that one. Um, also, you're going to see more of the CM shoot stuff with me and my buddy Joseph. Uh, we're both super fucking psyched for Expendables 2 and for Prometheus, so you can expect another CM shoots with that one. Um, let's see, what else? Um, in terms of, of Cinemasochist, um, I'm saying, um, a shitload. This is why I don't like uh, being off the cuff like, like this shit, especially when it's just talking about myself like this. When it comes to this show... I'll have to knock down uh, production values a little bit. Like, the episodes will will look more or less like this and sound more or less like this. Uh, I'm just using a digital camera and and my microphone, uh, not the, uh, my webcam's microphone. So, I mean, if if you guys think this is cool, like, if, if you don't mind this, if you can see me okay and if you can hear me all right, I'll, I'll continue with this. Um, I, I don't have quite as much free time... Uh, to get Joseph over here with the camera and to shoot the footage with his stuff and to render it and, and to get it on the computer. I have to really, like, I really should be working on my commissions right now. So for the time being, I'll have to just stick to using this sort of lower resolution and, and putting out reviews that way. I, I've got some, some reviews planned out. Um, I might do one that isn't even cinemasticus based. Like, I'm a big fan of the of uh, Giver Bio Booster Armor of both the manga and the movies, and I, I've always wanted to do a review of Giver 2, which in itself is like a retrospective on the first film, and the manga, and the cartoon, and, and all that kind of stuff. And I, I may put that out in maybe two or three weeks. It depends on how quickly I can get a, a script knocked out, but it should be easier. It's, you know, it's, um, I, I, I don't even think I really need to watch the movie to write that one, because I've, I, I can't even count how many times I've seen that movie since probably the age of 13. Uh, so those are some things you can expect. And I I don't even know. Was, I, I hope this is like a three or four minute video, but I don't know how long time passes when I just blabber on like this. But uh, thanks for listening. Thanks for watching the show. 
like you have no idea how much it means to me that I've had people that have followed me since like the first the first couple episodes and since like Anthropophagus because like you know, to me those episodes are garbage and it's just it's like it's I, I can't even fathom uh how awesome it is for you guys to be you know following me since then and I've only had like 20 episodes up I mean, that's that's awesome like that that really makes uh, drives me and pushes me forward more to to put out more episodes and to start writing more so it's like yeah I mean really thank you thank you guys so much for, for following the show uh, for for newcomers you know subscribe if you like it check out the other episodes um, you know like this video let me know that I'm that I'm doing a good job and uh, I'll, I'll try to keep entertaining you thanks take it easy <laughs>